Hey Gemini, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. And I hope all is well with everyone. Today we are going to find out some special or important general messages for you. This reading can apply to your love, career, friendship, or family situation. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not apply to each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me. Important messages for Gemini today. Wow, everything here is in reverse. I feel like a lot of things are being put on hold in your life right now. It depends. I feel most likely it has something to do with love's love because there are a lot of cups here, okay? Gemini, I feel like with the lovers here in reverse, even Ace of Cups in reverse, I f mm. it's a separation. Currently, I feel a lot of you are going through a separation with somebody from your past going through a lot of issues okay king of swords is in reverse and we've got the ace of swords here in reverse perhaps you and this person are not talking to each other right now or somebody is not telling the truth okay eight of cups is in reverse this indicates somebody who still hasn't moved on despite the separation with the two of cups here in reverse you could be dealing with a pisces cancer scorpio or it could be a fire sign aries sagittarius leo can also be a virgo capricorn taurus okay all the signs are here, it doesn't really matter, okay? We all could embody any of these energies. But Ace of Cups is in reverse here, so it looks like this was a new beginning that I felt was very romantic, very lovey-dovey, but it just didn't take off because lack of stability here with the four ones here in reverse um, could also indicate with communication with the King of Swords in reverse and the Ace of Swords here in reverse. In reverse, for some of you, it could be because of communication issues or it could be lying, somebody could be lying or that there is no communication at all currently between you and this person. Four Cups is in reverse. Somebody is also not communicating the fact that they still haven't moved on yet because the Four of Cups is in reverse. They're not communicating that because the swords are in reverse. But the Four of Cups here is in reverse. So definitely this indicates somebody feeling that this is a missed opportunity. Um, I really don't want to fight about it like trying to avoid drama but i still feel that this connection is a missed opportunity i hope that makes sense to you but five of wands in reverse also could indicate somebody no longer wanting to fight for this connection anymore just sick and tired of the drama uh, and with the empress here in reverse gemini you could be dealing with a virgo taurus capricorn it can also be a libra because the empress can be a libra as well so we've got the five pentacles here in reverse I do sense, Gemini, somebody is going to slowly try and sneak their way back into your life, okay? Um, with the Seven of Swords here. Also, what I'm worried about is... Hmm. What I'm worried about is this person, Seven of Swords here, maybe they may have some sort of ulterior motive, but I don't see it as really bad though, okay? Because um, the love is the same up first. So I feel like it's this person perhaps is making a choice to return, okay? To return, but in a way that is not very clear. Uh, because the swords are in reverse, they're, make, they're gonna make it like very, very unclear or can be manipulative in regards to how they want to try and return to you in your life. <laughs> okay, so we've got the equator ones here. Yeah, this can be an Aries, Sagittarius, Leo energy. So this person also, I feel that they may have put you in a third party. I do see that. Queen of Wands, I do read this person as a third party situation. This person with the lovers here, in reverse and the high priestess in reverse i do sense that they could have been keeping secrets but i think that most of you know okay most of you know whether they say it or not whether it's really out in the clear or not you i feel like a lot of you just know okay this is why you hold a lot of resentments towards this person because the king of swords is in reverse is actually your energy right gemini gemini Aquarius, libra it doesn't matter it's not gender specific so for some of you, you may be feeling upset or just not trusting this person because of the seven of swords and could be because of the third party. But let's see more. This has turned into a love reading because I'm seeing a lot of cups here and the lovers. Okay, but when it comes to finances, if any one of you are going through any 
uh, issues for your finances with the five pentacles here my friends it does indicate it looks like it's going to recover it's going to improve okay but three pentacles in reverse and five swords in reverse uh, spirit is definitely saying to not feed into if you work with people only for those people who work with people okay uh, to avoid drama that's what i'm seeing here and with the tower in reverse and the nine of cups here i do sense that that is somebody whom is trying to return seven of swords just uh, slowly try and sneak their way back into your life but again it's like in a very manipulative kind of way they're not going to make it super clear so i don't really like that energy but i feel like this somebody is going to make a choice to return or oh, it could be you okay gemini again rose can be reversed here because the queen of wands also indicates that there is still attraction there okay somebody could still be attracted to you or you could still be attracted to them but Gemini, this is also another message that I'm seeing. If you have been the Empress here, uh, now it's in reverse. Spirit is definitely saying to not give too much, don't nurture too much. Perhaps you could have given a lot to this particular person, okay, in the past. And this person still took something from you with the Seven of Swords, took something from you or lied to you. Um, so Spirit is saying to maybe to um, embody the Queen of Wands instead. That means no, um, to me the Queen of Wands is also kind of like the Queen of Swords, no BS, somebody very confident. But also to me this indicates, uh, to me I feel like Spirit is trying to say that you have to be very confident and believe that even when this person tries to return to you, believe that this is not the only person that you can be with, um, how do you say, during a lifetime, okay? You have other options. Nine of Cups is here. Make yourself happy. Be a little bit more selfish. And this is the reason why I kind of read the Queen of Wands this way because of the Nine of Cups to the Queen of Wands and to the Empress here in reverse. Hmm, interesting. All right, let's see a little bit more. So basically, Gemini Spirit is saying that you can have a lot. These are, can be options too, okay? You can have it all, but you just have to be confident that you can um, because this person is, again, I do see this person is trying to return. Sometimes that's a sense of like, um, that's a feeling of if, if I don't take this person back, will I ever meet somebody like this person again? Will I feel the same way again? That's what I'm getting here, all right? So two swords is in reverse. This indicates a choice. Uh, the fool is in reverse. Spirit says to make a choice to not be a fool here, okay? Because this is in reverse. So don't take any risks that you know beforehand. It's like this may have happened to you before, right? So you know that it's going to be a big risk to get back together with this person. So Spirit says to choose not to, okay? And we've got the hermit here. Um, Hermit and the Nine of Cups, it's a bit of a, a lone card, uh, isolating yourself. Perhaps it's, it's a good time to just you know, be on your own for a while. All right, uh, Gemini, this is your reading. Hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with a playlist on the screen right now. This is the playlist on my uh, second vlog channel. If you're interested, check it out. And also, I'm open for personal reading. If you guys are interested to interested, book me. My inf information is in the description box below. All right, take care, Gemini. Bye.